Hello everyone, my name is Python GB and welcome back to another episode of Survival in Minecraft. Thanks again for the insane amount of likes and support you've been showing for the series, I really do appreciate it. And of course, keep them challenge suggestions coming in if you want to have a chance of yours being used and your name shouted out. Yes! In case you are new to my channel, please don't be afraid, you can have your input on this series by leaving a challenge suggestion in the comments area below. And again, you know, you might have a chance of yours being used and your name shouted out. Hello villager, how are you doing today? You seem to be frozen solid. Look at him, bloody Obi-Wan Kenobi, that's how he has his arms. So why the hell are you doing it? You're not Obi-Wan Kenobi. I'm pretty sure Obi-Wan Kenobi doesn't have a big ass nose like you. Caveman Squidward, what the hell. Anyways, since the last episode, I haven't actually done all too much. Some of you guys noticed that Garfield wasn't on his little pedestal, but fortunately he is still there. Obviously his incessant meowing is still there, so that's all good. You know, it just means that he's still alive and that's that makes... Oh, that was a burp. And that makes me very happy. Okay, so, you are going to go back on your pedestal. I don't know why the hell you even came off in the first place. Okay, there you go. Okay, that's absolutely fine. And one thing I also need to do, I need to go up here. And I need to make a fence gate right there. Because one thing I didn't think about before spawning this villager is the fact that he will go through portals. And, you know, I don't want him to go to the Tropic Craft or the freaking... Never, because, you know, he will probably go ahead and die. But anyways, there are two challenges for this episode. One comes from a user by the name of Dylan Lowry, and it is to make an animal farm. And the second comes from a user by the name of Super Gudjigiz... Uh, something. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry, I suck at pronouncing names. Anyways, it is to make a furnace room in the basement. And I think it's not just going to be a furnace room. We're going to have some awesome furnaces. Maybe not diamond ones, but... Uh, Maybe, maybe, maybe iron ones. I don't know. Iron might be quite good to use in a furnace. Yes, I do have a more furnaces mod installed. And it is pretty freaking awesome. Look at this. You get seven slots. Unfortunately, it doesn't smelt them all at the same time. It just sort of, I don't know, cues them up essentially. And uh, it will do it all automatically. And it's absolutely fantastic. Oh my god. So, uh, what do we need? We need a furnace. Okay, which means getting cobblestone. Oh man, we don't actually... Oh, there's a skeleton in the background. Oh, look at him. Look in the background. Don't pay attention to my crafting. Not even I'm paying attention to my crafting. Look at him. <laughs> oh, you silly little sucker. Hold on a sec. We have to rectify this situation immediately. I have an infinity bow. And so, I reckon I can take him. Hey, dude. I need to barricade this place because if you die, then uh, I will never forgive myself. Stupid villager. Hey, there. Hey, would you like to die? Hmm? <laughs> I forgot, this has got punch on it. <laughs> That's awesome. It just knocks them flying. It's freaking awesome. Oh my god. Okay, so we have some furnaces going, which is awesome. We need to get some iron out, and we need to make ourselves a new room. I'm probably going to use that little space that I've got in the basement already. Uh, okay, hang on a sec. I'll show you what I mean in a minute. Uh, where's the iron? Oh, here we go, loads of iron. We could probably do with going mining properly. Because even now, I still haven't properly gone ahead and done that. All I've done is bloody rediscover our old freaking dungeons, and that's rather stupid. So, yeah, okay, uh, four iron furnaces. Oh, yeah, this makes me one happy chappy. Oh, my God. We still need to get a wolf companion. That's, uh, so many people are suggesting that as a challenge, and I'm just like, yeah, I know, I need to do it, but I got other things to do first, like safeguarding this place so our wolf won't go ahead and take down everything around the place. Ah, oh, hello. You decided to join us again. Nice to see you. Uh, okay. So, we have a load of random gems, and I don't see a reason why we shouldn't use them. So, yeah. Wait, can we make a Phoenixite pickaxe? Will that set things on fire? Oh, man. Oh, I've got to try this. I have got to try this. <laughs> a fiery pickaxe. Can you imagine that? i got to try it. Hang on, hang on. Oh, my. I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't believe I'm doing this. Oh my god, look at this stuff, it's so colourful! <laughs> oh my god, okay, we need to try something, hold on. Uh, let's just quickly go ahead and mine a random bit of stone and see what happens. Oh, holy mother, what the- Oh, okay, no, that's absolutely fine. You know, you can just set the ground on fire when I right click you. <laughs> that's awesome! Okay, so we essentially have a flint and steel and a freaking pickaxe in one. Yeah, that's pretty awesome, isn't it? Yeah, that's pretty boss. So what does this do? Does this have any special effects? What is it? Spinel or spinal. I haven't decided what to call it yet. Oh, wait. Could we just put the furnaces down here? Would, would that do the job? I reckon I should make a couple of rooms 
coming off here. Maybe them going downstairs. Maybe one goes to a proper, like, farm with pistons and such. And uh, the other one can go to a furnace room. Yeah. What do you guys think of that? Yeah. I'm coming with awesome things today. Holy crap. Okay, so we need some stairs. Or doors. Actually, no. Doors. Doors. We need doors. If this is going to be villager friendly, we need doors. Doors are good. Doors are what we need to expand and or breed our villagers. As we well know. Okay, there we go. Fantastic. Let's go downstairs. Oh my god. This is like... I don't know. It's kind of like the TARDIS from Doctor Who. It looks small from the outside, but on the inside, it's just a whole nother kingdom. <laughs> it's just like... Where in the hell did this land come from? Good lord. I do need to make like a proper little village outside as well. Obviously. You know, so the villagers can have a bit of a roam around and they can have their petty sex and stuff all over the place. And it'll be all good. Right, what do I need? What do I need? I was doing something important. Okay, let's do ourselves some of this. Oh, we really need cobblestone. Uh, I may or may not make a cobblestone generator at some point. I need to be careful when I... I really shouldn't right-click with my pickaxe. <laughs> Oh, God. If I set fire to my house, oh, the entire thing will just go up in flames. That's not even good. That is not even good. Oh, my God. This is one dangerous-ass pickaxe. But I guess it can be used as a weapon in some senses, which is pretty cool. You know? So it's nice to have a multifunctional pickaxe. So, yeah. Okay, so this is going to be... Okay, uh, if it goes down one more... Oh, okay, so apparently the dungeon's right there. Maybe that can make for a nice floor? Ugh, I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm sorry, I don't like it. It has to be... I don't want to have things that don't match. It just doesn't make sense to me. Oh, okay, we've got coal. That's pretty cool. I could actually do with that as well. All right. So this is like our first little mining expedition. <laughs> with a little bit of coal. Yeah, this has been such an epic expedition. Oh, man. Oh, okay. Oh, we can either go deep, that's what she said, or we can go backwards. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like this. This is just bad. Right, okay. Right, you're going to go in uh, there with some of this. Okay, that's fantastic. Maybe I should just make this wall into a furnace. I don't know. It could be a cool thing to do. Let's do it. Let's do it. One, two, three, four. It looks alright, but uh, the roof still looks weird. Urgh, if we're going to do that, we need the entire thing to be like that. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. It, it doesn't look right to me, to be honest. And for some reason, I kept going upstairs to craft stuff, even though I have a crafting table right here. Derp. Oh, my God. I keep forgetting I have these things, and then I just go to the original all the time. Oh, hello. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. We have come across old dungeon. Oh my, that's happening too often. That is happening way too often. We keep bumping into our old dungeon. I wish I could get rid of it. I don't want to dig it up. That would take hours. I could blow up with TNT, which would be fun, but uh, I don't think that would be productive all too much. So, yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I got, I've got ideas. What if I go ahead and put the furnaces, like... So, and then, we can have cobblestone on either side. Oh, that, looks, that actually works. I think that works quite nicely. Hold on. Oh, man. We're working with nothing here. We have got no resources whatsoever. This is so bad. I can't believe we've got a lacking of cobblestone. Despite everything we've dug up, we've just got nothing. <laughs> I never thought I would run out of cobblestone. Good lord. Yes, I understand that you are below me, zombies, but uh, I really, really don't need your input right now. No, I mean, I really, really don't. Oh, wait, hang on. Is there a chance we have, um... Is there a chance that we have cobblestone in the Twilight Forest? Oh, hey! Are you? Oh, no, he's just a normal ocelot. Hey, where'd the villager go? Villager! What the hell, man? What are you doing across there? Hey, man, you're so... I didn't just hear... Okay, that definitely wasn't my stomach. That was definitely a zombie pig, man. Right, okay. Dude, 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 please please come back over here. That's it, that's it. No, 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 no. Uh, zombie pig, man. 
Who would have them? I mean, villagers. Who would have them? People who want to trade things, obviously. Where are you going? What are you doing down there, man? <laughs> There's nothing down there. It's just a secret room which has nothing in it, you blithering idiot. Oh my god, he needs to get back to the house. It is getting dark. And he will therefore die if he's not careful. Dude, there is a house that you need to go in. I'm going to have to push you there. It's getting dark. Please, 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 please go into the house. Please go into the house. Please go into the house. Go into the house. God darn it. Please, please, please. I beg of you. Save yourself. Save yourself, you stupid. Oh, there you go. Okay. Right. Good Squidward. Good Squidward. Okay. Good stuff. Right. Okay. Well, at least we know he's safe. Kind of. Unless a zombie manages to break in. Which is entirely possible at my stage in the game. So, yeah. Right, okay, so what I'm going to do, because obviously villagers can't get through fence gates, I'm just going to go ahead and put that there. Hello! You are now a resident of the overworld. Wait, can I push you into the twilight forest? I've got to do this. <laughs> can I do that? Are you, are you going? Are you going to the twilight forest? No? Okay, okay that's fine, that's fine. Go on, go, go, go into the twilight forest, go on. Go on, you can make a new colony there. That'd be so funny. <laughs> Go on, you go back into your world. Go on, go on, go on, go on. I'm being nice today. He's gone back into his world. <laughs> I took him back to his homeland. I feel good about it. Oh my god, it's been so long since we've been here. Hello, Wuffy. Hello, Jack the Slime. Oh my god, it's been so long. Ah, right, let's go to sleep, shall we? That's what I feel like doing today. Ah, yes. It's all good. It's all good. Oh my god, look at all this cobblestone and a furnace. Damn, man. We've got some resources here, haven't we? Some wood. My god. Did I just hear a silverfish? Oh, no, that's not a silverfish. That's just one of those weird blue dudes that make those weird noises and drop things. Oh, apparently I can just sleep infinitely in this place. That's kind of weird. Oh, hey, look. Hmm, not too interesting. Just a little bit of iron. I don't know. I could make two more iron. Yeah. Alright, okay, let's do it. Two more iron furnaces to fill up the furnace room. And then obviously we need torches and such. Wait, can those blue dudes break down uh, break down doors? You do know what? I don't actually know. So that's going to be a new thing for me to learn. All right, Twilight Forest, it's been good. Holy, hello! What are you doing here? Well, I'm glad that you don't set things around you on fire. Oh, God. Hello! Oh, it's been a while. It has been a while. Oh, man. Oh, hey, it's a gigantic spider. Hey, giant spider! Hey! Hey, I'm going to set you on fire! There's nothing you can do about it, sucker. Ah, oh, what's the shame? <laughs> what's the shame? I mean, what's the problem or what's... What's the... I don't even know where that sentence came from, but it just did. But oh well, doesn't matter. We got what we got, went there for. Ah, oh, crap. And again. Stupid bloody portal transportation. Ugh. Right, there we go. Stupid floor portal. Oh, it doesn't matter too much. Okay, so, uh, we need... Oh, we've got some stairs. Of course we have. Okay, we're going to go down here. Uh, these are all facing the wrong way. Oh, well, doesn't matter too much. They're only facing the... Oh, no, now they're facing the right way. Will you guys make up your damn minds? Is this just a thing that happens? Or is, it, is, is it a bug? You know what? I don't actually know. Oh, well, it doesn't matter too much. Okay, there we go. Got some... <laughs> Oh my god, these furnaces are derpy. They are derpier than I am on a bad day. And believe me, me on a bad day is so unbelievably derpy that your brain would explode from the amount of derpiness that it has. Yeah. I don't want your guys' brains to explode, so I always try to record on a good day. So, yeah. Okay, what's the other challenge? Make an animal farm. Oh boy, this might be a hard one, actually. This might actually be a hard one. Oh, okay, so you're still there. That, that zombie must be in the dungeon then. I was getting worried for a minute, I'm not going to lie. I was actually getting worried. Okay, right, you can all go in there, and you can all go in there. Okay, fantastic. Right, okay, so what can we lure? We can lure sheep and cows. We can lure chickens. Hang on, where's the seeds at? Where's the seeds? I don't actually know. Did we use all our seeds? Oh, no, there's one there. Okay, so we can lure chickens. 
Do we have any carrots? Oh, dang it. We can't get pigs. Can't even get pigs. Oh, dear. It is night time. You know, I'm not I'm not risking it. I saw a creeper, and that might be the start of everything bad. So, you know, I'm just, I'm just going to go to sleep. You know, I'm just going to go to sleep. I don't want to risk it. Don't want to risk it. So, we could find chickens, cows, and sheep. This should be interesting. Because <laughs> I haven't seen any animals around here for a long time. Anything apart from ocelots, anyway. Holy crap. Oh, my God. Hello. Is there anyone here? Anyone? I see a zombie. Hello. How would you like to be set on fire? Like you should have been. Stupid idiot. You can't survive in the daylight. Neither can you. How dare you still be- Ow! You dare be alive? I will fire you to death! Can you just do me a favour? There we go. Just go and die. That's all good. Right, okay. Sheep, cows, chickens. Where you at? Either one of you three kinds of animals would be appropriate at this very time. Oh my god, look at this. Oh, we're venturing far beyond where we've been before. Actually, no, I'm pretty sure we've been here before. Oh, well, it does matter. Oh, wow. Okay. So, here's my theory. I reckon a lot of the animals that did spawn a while ago, I reckon they died in the quicksand. And that would make them very, very stupid now, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. Uh, okay. So, we're going to go down. Ow! Here! Oh, no. Okay. Oh, thank God. I thought we didn't bring food with us. And that skeleton is down there and that lighting glitch. <laughs> Should we go and mess up his day? Should we make that lighting work? Hmm? I reckon we should. <laughs> Head ow! Damn, man. I thought we were about to fall into the water, not into the freaking ground. That hurt. Damn, man. I really don't want to eat the regen apples either, because, you know, that would be a rather stupid thing to do. Now, I don't know about you guys, but sometimes I'm a bit eagle-eyed, and I'm pretty sure I saw a cobblestone structure over this way. What is that? Or is that another battle tower? Oh, God. Are they everywhere? They actually are everywhere. I can't get away from them. This is not a good thing. They are all over the damn place. I thought there was a village or something, but no, no. Why would it give me a village? An NPC village. That would have been awesome. Uh, what's over there? Nothing. Really? Are you are you going to give me any animals at all? I heard a spider. That's not entirely what I was after. But I appreciate the effort in trying to spawn something for me. Although it's not right, so you know. I kind of want to slap you across the face. Ah, stupid game. Gimme! Give Gimme give animals! My god. Ah, uh, we all know that Minecraft hates me. If you're new to my channel, that's one thing you should know about this game. It always has some kind of irrational hatred towards me, and it, uh, it never gives me what I want, and so... You know, animals sure would be appreciated, but uh, no, I'm probably not gonna get it, am I? No, why, <laughs> why would you give me what I wanted? Hmm? Oh wait, have we already explored these? Oh, okay, yep. Yeah. Little Farlanders chest house thingies. Ah, oh. cow! Oh my god, we got a cow! We need another one of you though. And some more wheat. We need wheat. Hey buddy! Hey, do you wanna, do you wanna come to my house? Oh no, we've got chickens as well. Oh man, it's now a battle. Can we find two of you before we can find two chickens? Oh no, and there's a sheep up there! It's a three horse race! Oh my god. Oh dear. There's pigs over there, but I can't get them because I haven't got carrots, which kind of sucks. So, I'll either have to go on a zombie rampage, or I'll have to try and find an NPC village, because they're the only ways of getting carrots. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. But I really want to try and get the cow back, actually, because, you know, they give you leather, which is used for books and armor, and they give you meat, which is used for food and such, so, yeah. And, uh, I may go ahead and jump cut this quickly. If I find any more cows on the way back, that would be absolutely insane. But, uh, once again, you know, Minecraft hates me. It's not going to give me what I want. Are you, Minecraft? This is this is the uh, opportunity where you can give me another cow. Sure would be awesome. Sure would be mighty nice of you. Seriously, seriously, where, where, where's the animals? Where's the animals? Hmm? Where, where's the animals? All I want to do is find a cow or a sheep or just two of any animal that isn't a pig or a hostile mob. Where? Where is everything? 
Where, 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 where? All we have is multitudes of pigs. We haven't got anything else. We can't make a farm with one animal. That doesn't make sense unless you can crossbreed them and have like a trans species species. Oh my god. There literally is no animals here, is there? Ugh. You see, it's times like this when I wish the old Minecraft uh, passive spawning mob code was back. Because uh, in the olden days, the, the passive mobs would spawn just normally. They would just spawn infinitely and they wouldn't depend on something else to spawn. But uh, in the newer versions of Minecraft, I'm pretty sure it's done by the biome they're in. And they also don't spawn infinitely. They only spawn like once every... Several hundred ticks, which is quite a long time, which kind of sucks. Uh, you know what, guys? I'm gonna go have to. I'm gonna go have to end the episode there. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. God dang it! I should have put another cow back. Uh, stupid idiot! Stupid, stupid, stupid idiot! Oh my god! You know what, guys? I'm tired of ending episodes and fails, so when I start the next episode, we're going to be in front of two cows that are in a farm. And that would be absolutely fantastic, because I'm being very dumb at the moment. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I shall see you guys next time.